So Sony got hacked again, how does it affect you, let's find out. Back in November 2014, Sony Pictures Entertainment fell prey to a cyber attack by a group identifying themselves as the Guardians of Peace. Many believe that these hackers were, in some capacity, connected to North Korea. They pilfered a vast amount of information from Sony's network, leaking it to journalists who subsequently reported on the embarrassing exchanges found within Sony's internal communications. It's the hack heard and seen around the world. Over 100 terabytes of data stolen from Sony Pictures. Leaking movies like Fury starring Brad Pitt and Annie with Jamie Foxx, along with private employee records and internal memos placed on the web for all to see. Now, reporters are digging through the documents, finding scandalous and in some cases embarrassing details. CNN Money has discovered that the hackers exposed the social security numbers of Conan O'Brien, Sylvester Stallone, and over 47,000 other Sony employees and contractors. CNN also found that the next Bond film, Spectre, which is set to debut late next year, is massively over budget. One executive secretly called it, quote, one of the most expensive films ever made. Another surprise, Tom Cruise was asked to play the role of Steve Jobs, but the deal fell apart and Michael Fassbender got the job. And if you're curious to know what stars call themselves when they're trying to stay incognito, well, now we know. Tom Hanks goes by Johnny Madrid is huge. Its parent company has a market cap of over $20 billion. So what exactly transpired during the hack? On Monday, November 24, 2014, Sony Pictures employees arrived at work to find their corporate network compromised. The cyber attackers had not only siphoned off huge volumes of private data, but also deleted the originals from Sony's systems. To add insult to injury, they left menacing messages, threatening to publicize the stolen information unless Sony met their demands. Regrettably, history seems to have a knack for repeating itself. Who is Ransomed VC? As of September 26, 2023, Ransomed VC is a notorious cybercriminal organization based in Russia that specializes in data extortion. Their modus operandi typically involves infiltrating networks, extracting sensitive data, and then threatening to release or sell this information unless a ransom is paid. Such attacks have grown more common recently, with many high-profile corporations being targeted by similar cyber threats. Thought the primary motivation behind Ransomed VC's actions appears to be financial gain. They demand hefty ransoms from major corporations like Sony, threatening to leak critical data if not compensated. According to Tech Monitor, the stolen data may end up for sale on the dark web, a marketplace for hackers and individuals with malicious intent. In layman's terms, their cyber attacks can be described as exploiting and compromising a company's data transfer mechanisms. Such vulnerabilities allow hackers unauthorized access to classified information, posing a risk of exposing customer data and potentially tarnishing Sony's reputation. The intricate details of Ransomed VC's recent breach into Sony's systems remain undisclosed. The extent of the damage and the volume of data stolen is still uncertain, as reported by Tech Monitor. Sony has not yet publicly acknowledged the security breach, and it remains unclear whether they are in talks with the hackers or are formulating other strategies to address the situation. What does this mean for consumers, and how can we protect ourselves? While the full extent and severity of these recent events remain unknown, it's essential for consumers to stay vigilant until Sony reinforces its security protocols. In the meantime, we can implement fundamental security precautions. Keep your software updated. Consistently refresh your operating system and applications to ensure you're protected from known vulnerabilities. Use robust, unique passwords, craft passwords that are hard to decipher, and ensure each online account has a distinct password. Consider employing a password manager for a secure way to remember and manage all your passwords. Activate two-factor authentication, 2FA. This security measure demands a secondary verification method, such as a unique code sent to your phone or a fingerprint scan, on top of your regular password enhancing protection. Stay vigilant against phishing attempts. Approach unsolicited communications with caution, whether they arrive via email, message, or phone calls, especially if they request personal data or login credentials. Refrain from engaging with dubious links or downloading attachments from unverified sources. Back up your data consistently. Safeguard your crucial files by frequently copying them to cloud storage, an external drive, or another secure destination. This routine will be invaluable during ransomware attacks or unforeseen data loss. Stay informed informed about cybersecurity developments. Regularly updating yourself about the latest cyber threats and protective strategies is essential. Trustworthy organizations and sources often share insights about prevalent risks and methods for online safety. 
Always remember, while no security system is invincible, you remain the most reliable defense between potential threats and your data. Cyber threats can manifest in various forms, including through apps, emails, phone calls, and even Wi-Fi connections. Should we be concerned about the future? No need for alarm. But as with all things in life, exercising caution and implementing protective measures for our digital data is crucial. This is Ashley signing off.